Back to Spartalfarm, huh? We still have unfinished business there. Those bloody <laughs> mining rigs in the bay, for <laughs> one. I'm good. <laughs> Mimir, were you really the one who had those rigs built? Odin wanted the dwarves under his control, and, well, I convinced him he could buy their allegiance instead of demanding it outright. A trade agreement of sorts. One of the mining rigs is here. See the smoke above us? That's where we're headed. Let's see if we can't shut it down. If the dwarves didn't like working for Asgard, couldn't they just quit? We do what? Their newly built forges poisoned the soil of Svartalfheim. Unable to grow their own food, they had to buy it from Asgard. If they stopped working, they'd be taking food out of their own mouths. Oh, that's clever. And awful. seed to moose behind think it might lead to that combat arena we visited years ago what makes you say that wishful thinking i guess going through surter's gauntlet it was fun it was training you didn't have fun hmm. well anyway we should look for the other half of the seed because it's whole again we can see where it leads Great. Now we can make it across. Behind you, father!
I'd grab whatever it spits up in the process. If the dwarves agreed to the deal with Asgard, why do they blame you? I talked them into their own exploitation. They need their choice. Work or die is not a choice. I only made it seem so. Brother, before we leave, perhaps it might serve us to check the rig and see if it spat anything up. What you just picked up there is pure Spartalfime ore. It won't be of use in the rig anymore, but perhaps our Holder brothers could craft something from it. Had them built to harvest ore for armaments, essentially harnessing resources that would otherwise go to the dwarves. You think shutting these things down will help the dwarves become independent? I don't know, but I have to try something.
Ugh, I hate the bay. The smoke from the rigs, it... My throat closes up. There's another mining rig on this island, brother. Smell that smoke. Why would the dwarves agree to work for the Ace here in the first place? That's the heart of it, eh? You lied to them. I lied to them. Okay, Mimir. To the blacksmiths of Svartalfheim, the creation of a weapon was a sacred thing. But Odin just wanted as many blades as he could get, as fast as he could get them. With every stolen resource and mediocre blade, the dwarves lost a bit of themselves. Odin would have wiped out every last dwarf in Sparklefheim. If he couldn't use their skills, no one could.
Smell the smoke? There's another mining rig here. You speak of your deeds with shame. Do you regret not allowing Odin to kill them? I don't... No. One less feathery spy. Bet we could swing across that, uh, lift thing. Gantry. Gantry. Thanks. Quite right. It's got to be the right spot. Those barrels smell fuel. Bet a spark from your blades would cause quite a boom. Break through the ground here if you found a high enough place to drop from.
Surprised the dwarves didn't shut these rigs off themselves. One or two tried. The Einher Yar made examples of them. They killed the dwarves? Can you have convinced them not to? Impressive. That should help. Yeah, that looks right. Oh, my God. 
If you could call so meager a task done. A wee drop out of the Asgardian occupational bucket. You must live with your deeds, but do not be troubled by them, brother. Oh? And why not? You are given an impossible problem. Do not blame yourself for failing to solve it. I'm sure the dwarves would feel differently. This doesn't fix things. No. But it is a start. A reminder, brother. That Svartalfheim slag we collected could be of considerable use in the hands of Broker Sindri. <laughs>